now. To be a man, you save so much money. To be a man, you save so much money. All men have to do is like eat. Shower. And shower. We have to do our hair. We have to have makeup. I get Botox. I get filler. I have to get, we have to get clothes, everything. Makeup remover. Makeup remover is expensive. Skincare stuff, expensive. It's fucked All up. Of it. It's fucked up. It's fucked up. I got to pay a lot to get my hair extensions fucking every couple of months. Are they sewn in? They're beads, so every, like, eight weeks, I have to have them moved up, and that costs me $400 every eight weeks. Just to move them up. Just to move them up. So I was like, if I'm not going to be on tour, we got to get, we got to get creative. Some cash. We got to get cash. But do you so. think if you had an unlimited amount of money, you would just go, like, crazy with the plastic surgery? I don't think I would go crazy with the plastic surgery, but I do think I would I think do I some could. things. Yeah, I, do, I think it could get dirty, well, like dirty and bad. Well, you think so? <laughs> I don't know. I think that like you lose sight of how, like, cause you keep doing stuff. It's true. It's and true. then all of a sudden you're like, what the fuck? I absolutely like, okay. So do you mean like you just like start doing stuff to like your body and your face? And yeah. So when I started getting my lips done originally, I got them so big, so fast, and it causes body dysmorphia because you like, I didn't realize that they looked bad. I genuinely didn't. And I didn't think they looked too big because you get used to seeing your face. Yeah. So I was like, no, they're just not big enough. They're not. And everybody was like, bitch, they look bad. And I was like, no, they don't. <laughs> you know, and then eventually I was like, yeah, okay, they're excessive. Well, and sometimes when you go to the place, they'll sell you on shit. They're like used car sales. They do. And my my lift girl now, she's like, I'm not touching you. And I was like, okay, I trust you and I do trust you. But if you don't have anybody telling you no, your body, like you don't, you just get used to well, it. Well, so sometimes they make suggestions. And they, they said, mm -hmm. I said, I think there's something wrong with my nose. She said, it's not your nose, it's your weak chin. It's your weak chin, right? Then I'm what, driving around like I have a weak chin yeah. and I didn't even fucking know it That's until exactly now. That's exactly it. You have a weak chin. And they do that. They fucking insult you and they say, well, in order to do, so what we're going to have to do is we're going to have to then define your jawline. Yeah, yeah. Give you filler here. And then we'll raise your eyebrows because guess what? They're a little bit droopy. Yeah. You're, don't you want a little lift? Yeah. Don't you want a little lift? Also, did you realize you're so ugly? So why don't we actually just give you an entire new face? Like they love to do that. They do. And you're like, how much is it going to be? They're like 1500 And you're like, wait, I'm sorry. What? Oh, 1500 I, I got Botox like two weeks ago and like for a couple of things it cost me like $400 just to get like, de 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 like they see me coming though because they're like well you could you also have some hollowness here I'm like I'm oh, hollow yeah. in my face yeah they love to tell you you're hollow you're Hol losing collagen <laughs> yeah, here yeah you're, you're under eyes they're like well it's just a little saggy yeah, they're like if it was me mm -hmm. I'd do it I think you're really gonna love it they love they, it they love to say I think you're and really I, gonna I love fall it for it it's, it's capitalism it's the patriarchy we it's fall so for it it's so fucked up and then it's like it's hard because then guys are like you don't need all that and then you're like you should see me without it and then, then you don't have it and then they go and then they all say why does she look so old? Oh, yeah. And you're like, because I did well, because I didn't, I listened, because I listened to you guys saying, I looked weathered. Yeah. Like, it, or I looked fake. I looked fake. So then you stop getting the stuff done and they're like, why does this bitch look old? It's like, we don't win. No, I know. And then the guys will come back and they'll be like, why do you, why do you care? And it's like, because we're, because we all care to an extent. We all care about what we look like and what other people think of us. Wouldn't it be nice to not? Yeah, I wish it was the 80s and no one was getting any of the shit. And we'd just look old as hell. Just and now old we just have to accept it. Dude. Right? Yeah. It's crazy. I mean, like the beauty standards of like, you know, of whatever eras, like completely dictate what we all find attractive. I mean, the Kardashians had a lot to do with that. Yeah. They, they're, they're the people to blame. They are. They're the people to blame for what we look like right now. Like what. Society, society and the is. Bratz dolls. Okay, but I fell for that one big time. I love the Bratz dolls. <laughs> Bratz dolls can fucking get it. They're so Bratz cute. Bratz dolls are so cute. They're, they're so cute. Bratz dolls way over Barbie, dude. I would rather look like a Bratz doll than a fucking Barbie. Yeah, because Bratz dolls are... Oh, look at how cute they are. Oh my God, the one with the blue eyeshadow. Miss Thing. <laughs> how much is a Bratz doll? They're so cute in their fashion. Get out of here. Is it like $30 maybe? Brat stalls had it going. I order a brat stall at 37. <laughs> like the fashion inspo. You know, like every episode you just have more and more brat and more. Stalls. Yeah. Oh my god. They are the beauty standard. Dude. That okay, I'm not mad at them being the beauty standard. What would you rather what do you think has shaped culture more? Barbie or bra Barbie? Barbie because she's been around longer. Yeah. But the brat stalls, 
The brat stalls seem like they've had work done. But the brat stalls, are, the brat stalls are for like the baddie girls. I feel like Barbie is for like the all like Orange County. For like honestly, most like basic. It's like what, like the ideal. I don't know if I'm making any sense, but like I like think a realtor in Orange County that men find attractive. Like she's safe, she's thin, she's tall, she's blonde. She's you go, got the titties. She's got the titties. She's got the no puss. She's got the tiny tight pussy. <laughs> you yeah. know the brat stalls have lips. 